I'm Bryce Bay. I'm the CEO of Inveritas Group, and I'm happy to be here presenting the uh, CMI B2C Research Roundtable Series. One of the other things that came up in, uh, in these, these surveys is the, the need and increasing need for finding trained content professionals. It's, it's almost tripled in terms of a priority. Wow. Um, I'm wondering what you're seeing out in the, the space. Uh, a few years ago, it was everyone was a content uh, specialist and, and strategist. Nowadays, I think uh, it's hard to find the ones that are truly good. Smoke is cleared. Yeah, yeah exactly. <laughs> <laughs> so who, who wants to wade into that pool? Well, I'll make a comment on that one. I think last year we talked about the gap between brands investing in content and the documentation of their strategy, et cetera. And here we are in, a year later and we're seeing the need for more training. I think that's really, really interesting. Last year we saw a big gap, and I think this year brands are looking to close that gap, and I think they've discovered maybe they don't have the right personnel or the right uh, agencies or partners to do that. Yeah, I think, I, think it's, I think a year is long enough to determine that the people they thought they hired that were awesome uh, haven't been able to deliver on what they thought they'd be able to deliver on, and maybe the expectations have changed. Um, for even not just the person, but the organization's you know investment in content. Exactly. There's Sorry. oh no, I should say there's also just a lot more formats. So yes. you know we used to have you know our creative ad agencies who were producing all of the videos, sure. and then we realized well, geez, that's really expensive, <laughs> and maybe we don't need that same kind of production quality. And so we looked at others, and then you get you know Vine videos, and you get like Insta videos, and like who do you need to shoot a, a six second or a fifteen <laughs> second? And then it turns out there's these cottage industries of Vinographers who actually are really, really good at it, and they have their own built-in audience. Yeah. So some of this change and evolution is just because everything is changing and evolving so quickly. That's true. I like your comment about the smoke's <laughs> the smoke's cleared, <laughs> and I think the expectation of yeah the the, the the internal sophistication and expectations of organizations has definitely mm -hmm. matured in the last. You know, and we were talking about it earlier. The the this the the scope and the the sophistication with what. Um, we're all doing now has changed so much even in this last 12 month period um, absolutely I think people are more educated and can smell BS in the air when um, when they're talking with 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 people and are trying to re we're all recruiting from a very small pool of people who've actually had deep experience so what advice would you give to companies out there that are trying to find you know the right professional I mean is it just a process of, of, of sourcing talent, the tighter, tight talent pool, or do you train up internal staff? I, I think you, maybe you don't focus so much on, on solving the content problem and maybe put the credence in your partner's ability to solve an integration problem. The biggest integration challenges I think we're having these days are platforming challenges, right? We've got a CMS, we've got a DMS, we've got a DAM, we've got site support. The, the, the challenge with everything that we do is how do we make all of the pieces work together? And for us, it's just you know that much bigger because we've got 25 different brands and different agencies and lots of different challenges. I, 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 think, I think if you're looking for the right people, Looking for a marketer or a writer or a videographer is not the right approach. Mm -hmm. And even looking for a content strategist might not be. I think that helps. But I think what you really have to focus on is understanding the audience you're trying to attract with content and actually looking for people who understand the audience, who have domain knowledge and expertise that's beyond your product or your category, but understand the audience way better than you. It'll give you a leg up, and they'll understand what the audience consumes, where they consume it, and that helps you get through some of the where do I, where do I put this content challenges, what kind of content should I be producing, and, and it gives you a, a, a leg up and some credibility, and they might even bring audience like, like mm -hmm. Julie talked about. Thank you.